Hey, what's up, people? We're about to show you how to wet sand a bumper. Let's go outside first. Oh, look how pretty it is outside. The sun all out and shit. Oh, there go my car. How sexy. Oh, yeah. We coming to fix you up. You already turned on the water? Yeah. Who the hell playing? Oh, I hate that song. So, yeah, we about to take this ugly bright blue and paint it all black. But first, we got to get it sanded down. And that's what we're about to do right here. Now, the wet sand bumper, you need to have water, soapy water on it at all times. So, we're about to go get the hose, wet this down, and sand it down real nice. Hold on. Now, I forgot to tell you, I'm being lazy, and I'm actually keeping the bumper on the whole time while I'm sanding it because it's jerry-rigged on there. See, look, if I try to take that off, it'll just all hella break loose. So I'm just going to try to paint it while it's still on the car. So, yeah, we're about to see how this come out. All, all I got was some painter's tape. To, where's that painter's tape? We got paint, paint. Where's my tape at? Ah, there it is. Rust-Oleum paint. Yes, yeah, very ghetto. And we got tape. Painter's tape. Let's see what we can do with this. Uh, we need some kind of soap. Dish soap. Oh, tripped up stairs. I do? Where? Woo! Hotter than the devil's draws out here. Oh, we do got a spider on. Mm, a little tiny, a little tiny. It ain't a beat if it ain't a beat. All right. Now, as you can see, he's wetting up the bumper because it's easier to sand when it's wet. Unfortunately, I lost my uh, sanding block, so we had to use, we had to improvise a little bit. You know, I hate baseball, so we used this MLB 64 game and just stuck a piece of uh, hard grit. It's a, I think it's 80 grit to it, so yeah, it'll, it'll work just fine. I fucking hate baseball. I'm about to get my Xbox on, alright? Alright, so it's been like 20 minutes and I'm pretty sure that the bumper is dry now. But we had to relocate because of the bad factor. Yes, B-A-D, bitch ass dad. So I had to move like three houses down. And we're about to look at the bumper and start painting. Uh, let's see. See, look, we had to move all the way down here. Just because he wanted to be a bitch about his car. At least I got my own workspace though. And let's see. Open that up. There we go. Eh, you probably can't see it on the camera, but it's all nice and scuffed up. And yeah, we're about to start getting painted. That didn't even make sense.
and now paint will commence. Commence. We're using rust oleum, the protective enamel. That's basically like the the paint and the gloss in the same can. Cause I'm cheap and I don't have money for clear coat. So yeah, we're using it. So we forgot to cover the trays. As you can see, we had to get these in case real quick. Shit, it's dirt everywhere. Cause I just pulled that root up. Yeah, that look oh juicy mm. that look beautiful look at that oh mm. oh yeah and we're gonna come back for the finished product as you can see I didn't expect to have this much paint left so we're gonna actually go ahead and paint the front bumper we got like two and a half cans of paint and